actually I do. <laughs> I often feel guilty <laughs> when I support fast fashion brands. I am not keeping them. I am returning both of them. But I do have two items more that I'll have to show you from Zara and I've also taken fabric into consideration as well and need. But anyway guys, the best are yet to come. So, so I've just returned from Zara and as promised, there are a couple of things that I actually think I prefer than the two trousers that you, you've just seen. So, this is my substitute for the two trousers that I've just returned. And again, it's very me and it's very similar in style to the green one that I got at Zara um, two years ago. This is the piece in question and yes guys, ugh, it's the very same style. So when I saw that pink piece, I knew that it would be flattering on me. It's such a great piece that you could casualize as I've done here, but you could also wear this on a casual Friday. I love that, but I am not going to be too quick just yet. When I try it, then I'll know for sure how I feel about it. Okay, so it's a winner for me, guys. I love the fit. I love that I could get so much wear out of this piece. Now, really, really love it. It's absolutely gorgeous. And it's 100% cotton. The material is much sturdier than the ones that I've just taken back. So this for me, it has passed the first test. But so with this look, I'm giving you office chic because I went into the office today to grab a few stuff. So yes, I did manage to go outside and tested this pants. It definitely stood the test of time. Today was about 40 degrees Celsius, guys, and it was cool under my pants. So this is definitely a keeper. So I've cared my high-waisted pants that I absolutely love. Today is so hot, guys, and as a first impression of this pants, it's really, really airy, it's very lightweight, and it's definitely doing its job on a hot summer day, so I love that. And of course, the H&M top, so this is today's look, and it's a great alternative look, just to make it a bit more office appropriate, so love it. If you're not a dress or a skirt person in the summer, a wide leg is a great alternative. It offers ventilation. I just love the way these two pieces fit into my office wear. I think that the style is definitely very flattering, very ventilated, and you just feel great. It's definitely a new favorite for the summer and here we thought that we would be bypassing summer 2020 but yeah I went out guys and I really rocked the hell out of this piece. I think I have a clip somewhere that I would show you. I love it. I really do. It's very flattering and the color is definitely very cheerful so it's a piece that would remain in my wardrobe 
forever. This is a forever piece for me, guys, whether the color is in or out. So I've put together a few bullet points about what you need to know when it comes to organic as well as conventionally grown cotton. Hope you learned something. I love it. So far. Sorry to interrupt guys, but just a quick note. Hi guys. If you just so happen to just click on my video, you are new, please click the red subscribe button. So here they are guys. If you click on these buttons, you'll be part of my channel and you'll be notified when I post new videos. And most importantly guys, it's free. Thank you so much for subscribing. Love ya. Let's get back to the video. Next piece I got. And oh, by the way, this is on sale because no matter what, regardless of whether or not an item is on sale, I always look for the fabric material first, then my style, then the fit. So the second item is this gorgeous slide. And I love anything with bows. It's, it's beautiful. It's a great neutral piece. It goes with absolutely everything in my closet. So the toes are just out after quarantine. So excuse them a bit. But I love the big bow detail on this slide, guys. I would have for years my only concern right now is that the bottom sole is very, very, very smooth. So it's almost like an accident waiting to happen, but I'm going to ease myself into it. It was on sale for $30, so it's 100% leather and I love that. I absolutely love that. The reason I love this is because it doesn't take a lot of leather to make this shoe. You know me when it comes to leather. Leather for me, it's very important that you consider where your leathers come from and that it is sourced from meat products. So it's a byproduct of the meat industry. So. This for me is something I could definitely live with and because it doesn't take much fabric to make this piece, I absolutely believe that these are made from pieces that were just leftovers from other items. So I'm definitely happy to be utilizing this in this way. So this is a winner for me. In, a, in a many ways so great summer piece stick your feet in and you're out the door because of everything so far so good and someone got a really cute white 100% linen shirt Ooh, this is gonna look so fab. Would I get him to try it on? I don't know guys, but we'll see. But it's a really, really great piece and I'm so proud of him for his choice. The style is gorgeous, it's white, it's summer friendly, an absolute great must have for the summers. So definitely has my seal of approval. Love it. And you know what? If he doesn't try it on, I'll try it on because you never know. I might wear it myself. So <laughs> we'll see. <laughs> so we got him to try it on, guys. And I think it's a really great fit. Linen is such an excellent choice for the summer months because it's breathable and it just looks absolutely just i find it looks so chic so elegant it's a great choice i just love to see it on men and this in every color would 
definitely be the ideal piece for a minimalistic wardrobe for any guy so it's something I would recommend for this particular piece it's from the sustainable side of Zara the join life line so yes that's an added bonus and you can wear it of course this way as well as you can roll the sleeve down so either you show some really good gams or you just yeah wear it as you see fit really really love this piece so since it's gonna be a keeper we gotta get rid of the tag so let's do it oh wow I enjoyed that and while I was in the line I saw this item and I jumped out quickly out of my spot in the line and grab it it appears to be unisex but we'll find out pretty soon if you see me try it on it means that it's not man's approved so <laughs> So it was definitely not man approved. <laughs> it is a woman's jacket slash coat, blazer, however you wish to wear it. I'll be wearing it multiple ways, as is right now, because I love navy blue with brighter colors. Ah, I love this piece, guys. We'll see how it goes, but for me, I think I could absolutely rock this as well with a huge broad belt. And of course, I had to hit you with my double belting style. It's me. I can't help being me. So here I am again, pairing this with my two favorite belts. <sighs> Oh my gosh, guys, this is such a great piece to wear out, but it's often important to pay attention to your leather items that you intend to buy new. The Zara belt is about two years old now, and the Prada piece is a piece that was thrifted on Vestier Collective, so second hand is definitely grand. I love it. Again, the material, very sturdy. It appears to be linen, but I'll definitely leave the material information on the screen. So I've also got this Jacquemus. Very wide leg. This is made from very thick viscose. I think it is probably a combination of linen and viscose but they say that it's viscose only so I'm gonna assume that this is where viscose is born and the rest that we often come across it's just totally stretched beyond limitations that's why sometimes it's so flimsy for example, these two pieces, they were definitely stretched to the thinnest you could find and it's one of the main reasons I returned them. This, oh my god, it's amazing. And initially I got the size 12, which you would see there. So this piece was bought on matches fashion and oftentimes I kind of get mixed up with international sizing so I got this in a size 12 and I was also thinking since I put some weight on a size 12 might fit but obviously not so it didn't fit it was too big so I had to return it to get a size but this 10 this is a size 10 and it's the perfect fit it's a bit of a hot mess right now because I folded it and had it um, on a hanger. So, should I still try it on? Because I don't really feel like going to iron this right now. My mom told me 
Yahoo's. And this is what it looks like, guys. Oh my gosh. Love it. Quite an investment, but really do love it. This is what you call viscous. This pants is a representation of what this course is all about. It's like, yeah guys, it's the real deal. I hope you enjoy this haul and I hope that whenever you go shopping at any fast fashion brand, yes, I know the reality is you're going to be influenced. You're going to see many hauls online, on YouTube that would just itch your pocketbook and you would want to spend and now that COVID-19 is easing a bit and we are transitioning to the outside again you're likely gonna want to go shopping so fabric fit and style is definitely the way to go hope you enjoy this video and i'll see you in the next